What's, What's up, guys? guys? Welcome back to, to the, the channel. channel. And today we're gonna be doing a draw my life video. video. Oh, and we said that shit at the same time. Yeah, you owe me a soda. Why you always say that stupid ass shit? I don't always say that. Yeah, you do. It's the first time saying that. Nah, you say that. But anyways, guys, uh, excuse me for doing the bubble letters. Excuse a, Jordy for doing bubble letters. This is taking a while. But yeah, man, we're going to be basically drawing our life. So, hope you guys enjoy. Give this video a thumbs up if you guys are ready to... <laughs> Watch. <laughs> Alright guys, so for those who know, we're twins, and for those who don't know, now you know. Yeah. So I first start off with my mom's getting pregnant, you know what I'm saying? <sighs> you know what he's saying? Follow along. <laughs> Alright, so we both were in the same womb. And we were in this, oh yeah, Jory said it. <laughs> <laughs> um, If you guys didn't know, me and Jory are identical twins, and to be honest, I don't really feel like me and him look that alike. But to a lot of people, they feel like we do look exactly the same. Yeah. Sorry for um, ever. Sorry for my hand. Right. I couldn't write in that angle. I think you just can't write in any angle. And so, yeah, oh. we're identical twins. Shots fired. <laughs> I right, watch out this video. All right, so we were born June 16, 1998. Um, um, I Long forgot what time, what time we were born. Yeah, I forgot. But I think, no, nah, I don't know. Um, I want to say like 12. Oh, right, right here. Midnight, but I'm not sure. I don't want to Yeah, it. I was thinking midnight, but I don't know. Right, so my mom was um going to have an emergency C-section. I Be think she was born for like an appointment, right? Yeah, an appointment. And, and the reason being was because ever, um, I, w um, I switched posi position or something like that. Yeah, Jordy got like in front of me somehow. And so like he was blocking the food from getting to me. So I was like basically like dying. Yeah, he wasn't getting any food and uh, they had to take out ever fast ASAP. Yeah, and so he was the first born. Yeah. So we were one minute apart. And I think I was the heavier one, so I was like five, five pounds. Five pounds, and I was on four, four pounds. pounds. Just because like, I was getting more of the food, just because of... And we obviously were um, premature, too, because we were supposed to be born in July, July born, right? Yeah. So we ended up being born in June. So then once we got home, we would uh, <coughs> cry a lot, and our older sister would um, tell my mom to take us back to the hospital. Uh, she was in elementary school at this time. That's yeah, now pretty, she's like twenty. That's pretty funny. Five, six. <clears throat> um, and she will help up mom, help my mom out a lot too when she could. Yeah, for a little girl, she would try. Yeah, she liked taking care of me more because I was like the smaller one. Yeah. And I guess it was easier for her. And as you guys could tell, well, I don't know if you guys could tell, but <laughs> we were crazy. We were crazy growing up. Once my mom said that we um. She couldn't look. She couldn't find us, and we ended up um, hiding inside a fridge for like twenty minutes. I mean, I don't know if she was exaggerating, cause you know, I don't know. I feel like my mom sometimes exaggerates, but yeah, I feel like um, we put parents, two minutes. Spanish parents are like ex ex exaggerate a lot. Yeah, we put. I put like two minutes, cause like I don't know. I feel like twenty minutes Dead sounds eyes. like a lot. I feel like but we I, for, I forgot how she ended up finding us in there. I don't, I don't know. She said something told her to open up the fridge. <laughs> Yo, we were crazy. Who yeah, the fuck gets to the fridge? And she said when she opened it, like, we were just smiling, looking at her. <laughs> and so, growing up, we loved playing video games. We were all the into video games. I mean, we still we are. We still are. And we were also... Uh, Very athletic. We played um, a lot of sports growing up, too. Um, we started off playing baseball and it, basketball yeah. and soccer. We Those were, like, our three sports that we played growing up. And then we just started playing basketball and soccer way more than baseball. We ended up leaving baseball behind. We fucked with um, basketball and soccer more. And then we just stick to... At one point, we just stuck to playing... um Soccer, because that was like our main sport. Yeah, our favorite sport. We all love watching it <coughs> with our, our dad and shit like that. Like the World Cup and Champions League and all that. And yeah, sorry for... <laughs> the drugs. Yeah. Soccer. <laughs> <laughs> soccer ball. But yeah, um, we ended up joining a team, like a club outside of school and shit. 
but then uh, came in like a trainer that we didn't fuck with as much, so we ended up leaving. But mainly the reason why we ended up, <laughs> ended up leaving was because moms were struggling, yeah. and we got a job to help her out, and we were working a lot. We ended up moving like to like five different houses. Um, growing up, I guess. Um, don't we live in now? Currently, is surprisingly we stayed here for yeah, this long. The longest we lived in this house, the longest. We moved to this house that we currently live in since. It was sixth, sixth grade, yeah. yeah. Uh, so this is where um, we met our neighbor for the first time, and his name is Jose. Uh, we got mad cool with him. He saw us like balling up once, and he's like, "Yo, I saw you guys shooting dunks." That's why we put that right there. And guys, sorry for if um we say um a lot. I feel like we keep saying that. Mm-hmm. But yeah, he ended up moving away to North Carolina where my dad lives. Mm-hmm. And we still <clears throat> keep in touch through Xbox and we text. And oh, shit. Yeah. We still keep in touch. And I recently visited him. Well, I visited my dad out there and I got to meet up with Jose too and shit. It was pretty lit. Yeah, but I didn't get to go because uh, me and Gabby were moving into our studio and we had a lot going on, so. So yeah. it was just me, my girlfriend, uh, my sister, and, and her boyfriend, and her three kids. Then went to go visit him. And um, Jose and me and Ever went to school together in middle school. And we were, we were pretty stupid. We would do stupid shit. And for some reason, I can't really remember why, we got written up in the bus once. I don't know, it was pretty funny, I guess. We used to, to do us. stupid shit. Yeah. I saw. <clears throat> we were only like 15 years old. And I feel like this is when, like, uh, you need, like, I guess your parents the most. And my dad decided to move to North Carolina. We, mm-hmm. up to this day, not really too sure why and he ended up doing that. Till this day, too, we feel hurt about it. It's what brings us, you know, like, sadness at times. Yeah, sometimes we feel bummed out and, like, sad about, but... I mean, the good thing is that he never stopped talking to us, though. We still talk. Yeah, we always kept um, in kept touch. Kept in touch and shit, but... But I know that's something that really hurt us a lot Because yeah. we, we were really close to him Yeah, we used to hang out with him a lot uh, On the weekends, uh, mainly because he worked From Monday through Friday a lot So every weekend we like do shit with him Hang out with him, go to the movies Go to the mall, buy breakfast in the morning So things got really difficult financially And food was like Like very limited um, There was times we couldn't wait To wake up the next day So we could be able to eat Like breakfast yeah, and shit most of, Sometimes we would be starving And shit every day Yeah we would go to sleep Starving sometimes And Sometimes we didn't have food To eat all day After that first So meeting. me and Ever Always liked um, Watching YouTube And then Ever One day came up with the idea Like yo We should become YouTubers Yeah Let's make some Funny lit ass videos And I feel like me and him Were like clowns In general And like cre- Like we would joke around We're creative day. So I feel like we 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 could have put that to use with like YouTube videos and you know make a living off um just doing something lit and having fun with it. I sometimes we end up falling off because we feel like the views aren't as good as we expected it to be. So it really like motivates yeah, us yeah, and like motivates some us. of the videos ideas we feel like only a certain amount of people will fuck with it and others wouldn't. Regardless, me and never want to be more consistent and like put out more content. Me and never really enjoy putting out content for you guys. And yeah, man, it's crazy how we came a long way because we first start, started off recording on a phone and then we upgraded to a G7X camera. And our hard work has paid off and it's still paying off till this day. Yeah, I mean, we had this video pre recorded already, so we put 31,000 subscribers, but we're at 32,000 now. And, and we want to say thank you to those who show us the love and support. We really do appreciate you guys and love you guys so much. And yeah man we're gonna if you keep guys, on putting videos for you guys if you guys enjoy this video man give this video a big thumbs up comment subscribe. and subscribe and as always we'll see, see you guys, guys on the next video, video. Peace. peace one more thing i forgot to mention is that i accidentally deleted a clip about me speaking about Thiago and gabby so basically uh me and gabby met Thiago was born on june 23rd 2018 and he's the biggest blessing in my life so us having Tiago, me and Gabby decided to move in together so that way we could have our own privacy and like grow together as a family. That affected me and Ever a lot, but obviously that didn't stop us from seeing each other, you know, getting together and trying to put out content for you guys since we have a YouTube channel together. That's pretty much it, guys, and we'll see you guys on our next video. Peace.